come to plant a garden TV. How are you guys doing? All right, guys. Today we're gonna apart a sugar apple tree. This is actually a sugar apple tree. So I'm going on up part it, but I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna prepare the container. If you notice, the container is small. Some people will leave this in that container. Some people gonna say if they put it in this, it's gonna be too heavy. So you gotta be mindful of that. You can leave it in this, or you can transplant it in this, but you gotta be mindful because it might get too heavy and you might be able to lift it. But me now, I have a cart, so I'm gonna be using the cart to put this inside. So first, I'm gonna bore a hole to the center. You could even pop, and I'm gonna put one more hole. One hole I'm gonna put in the center. And as you guys know, that one hole is what gonna attract the earthworms and other things up into the container. So I'm preparing it just like in as nature prepared. So what I always do, I always add the leaf to the bottom and I always add this type of stuff to the bottom. Okay? Then after I do this, what I do, I take some soil and I'm add the soil to the bottom. Okay? We also have more soil here. If you notice this, you see the kind of what I'm adding? This is what I'm adding. Sticks and leaf. All this gonna break down and turn into manual for this plant. No, this is the plant right here. So if we we can cut down the container or we can pull it out. But let me just see how hard it is. If it's hard, I'm okay. All right, okay. So yes, now I'm gonna put it down inside of the container. So now you see it have more room for it to actually spread. So what I'm gonna do now, the reason why I'm adding this type of material to this is because this plant love organic matter and it also love its root to be drained. So I'm trying to create that type of soil that's gonna be able to drain every time you wet it. So guys, this is what I'm doing. Now what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna add a, some soil on top of it. Okay, so now, What we do here, we create something more space for the plant. This can stay in this container for at least three to four years in this container. And by that time, I might want to put it in a bigger container or I might just want to use a different plant. What I'm going to do after this season, I'm going to uh, layer it right here. Earlier, so after it root, I cut it off, and now the bottom gonna spread out, and then I'm gonna use the top for a new plant. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoy. Peace, love, and blessing. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share.